everyone i am rishpa jain your maths teacher welcome to you all in online classes i hope you all are studying well as you know we have completed our chapter 3 shapes and patterns so today we are going to start chapter 4 geometry to learn about this chapter we need some geometrical instruments like pencil eraser sharp no ruler ruler means scale protector that is g and compass so bring your geometrical instruments for learning this chapter now in this chapter we are going to start with basic geometrical concept in which we will learn about point line line segment and ray now we are going to learn these four things separately one by one now you can copy the work in your rough notebook now we are going to start the first basic geometrical concept that is point have you ever heard about the dot yes we have heard many times and how can we draw it we can draw a dot with a sharp pencil so we can say this dot is known as point so first point is represented by Now you can start writing it in your rough notebook. Now we are going to learn rest three basic geometrical concepts: line segment, line, and ray. We will learn all these basic concepts in a tabular form on the different bases. Now we are going to start with line. Now I am drawing a line here. What can we observe in it? We can observe. I have drawn. of the 
name like this. So, it is defining itself. We are talking about the line AB. Now, we will learn about the real life example. What do you mean by real life example? Real life examples that we can see in reality. So, for line, we have two examples like highways and roads. Do you ever seen highways? If I am telling you to stand in between the highway and will tell you to see your left and right, so what can you see there? We cannot able to see. We cannot able to see the ends of that highway. It is moving continuously. So if it is moving continuously in both the direction, so this is line. So we can say the real life examples of line are. Highway or road. Now we are moving forward to line segment. For learning about this, first we need to know the meaning of segment. The segment. Segment means a part. So it means line segment is a part of line. How? See. A part of line means when I am taking only this part of a line. So I will draw only this part. It means I have a starting point and the ending point. If I have the starting or ending point, so its length is fixed. How many number of end points? There are two. One and two. First starting point and second end point. What is the symbol? Symbol will be same. A line with two dots at both ends. How can we draw the example? Same, a line with two, two dots at both ends and the points will be named with capital letter. Same, how can we write the name? It will be AB or BA. But, same as line, we will use the symbol at the top of it to define that we are talking about line segment. Now, this is the time to know the real life example. Can you see this? What is in my hand? I have marker. Is the length fixed for it? Yes. Do it. Uh, do this marker have two points? Yes. First, second. So, if the length of this marker is fixed, it has two end points. So, this is the example of line segment. Can you observe the pencil in your hand? Yes, it is also fixed length. It is, it is having two end points. So the pencil is also a, a, an example of line segment. Have you ever observed the ruler? Yes, the length of the ruler is fixed. It is, I, uh, it is 30 cm in a ruler, in a short ruler. So its length is also fixed. It is also having two end points. So this is also the example of line segment. So we can write pencil and ruler. As the example of line segment. Concept of ray will be discussed tomorrow. Now it's time to get homework. So today homework is do getting started exercise of Chapter 4 that you can get on page number 97 in book. Now, before finding today's class, I just want to say stay home, stay safe and please like and subscribe my channel to get the notification for the latest update as soon as possible. And viewers, kindly mention your name, class and section in comment box. Thank you.